So uh, two days in, what do, you, what do you think of the team and how things are going? Uh, it's been feeling pretty good, you know, just uh, linebacker core has been feeling really strong and really smart and just gonna keep it going. You know, every day has been a different objective and we've just been doing our thing. What's been Johnny's message to you over the last week? Um, just knowing the playbook inside out and just uh, backers communicating to other backers. Um, getting that extra film work with the younger backers, you know, just showing them the ways and how to fill their gaps and just know their drops, stuff like that. Uh, Jacob Manu, uh, playing alongside him, what's it been like? Yeah, I love Manu, man. He's my guy. He's a very hard-nosed backer, and uh, I feel like we play alike and play off each other. So we're going to keep it going. And just every day has been a, a new just opportunity, and we love it. Has there anything, been anything that surprised you about Jacob that you've learned over the last couple days about him? Um, just his competitiveness, like he brings it every day. I love to bring it every day and we just feed off each other. So I've been feeling pretty good. What have you seen out of the new guys on the team, the freshmen, coming in and trying to, you know, compete in their first spring camp? Yeah, uh, man, the freshmen been looking really good. Um, a few of the young guys, you know, they got to come in and, you know, just do a little bit more film work and just, you know, fine tune the brain. But I feel like the young guys are going to come through for the team. What would be your biggest advice to them? Because you know, you're in a similar boat two years ago. Uh, say that one more time, boss. You're in a similar boat, you know, when you were a freshman. So what's your biggest advice to them? Um, just basically don't waste a day, you know. If you're a freshman and you don't really know what you're doing, you got to be in here. You got to really put in the time because you can't cheat football, you know. You can never cheat football, so that's all I'll say. Is there a defensive lineman who stood out to you so far? Uh, you know, I like Tyler Manoa. He's always flexing and always bringing the energy. Uh, I like Bill Norton. He's a really good cat. You know, I love him. You know, I love them all. They're all good D linemen, and we're going to come through and, you know, we're going to do something this year. So you and Bill have a pretty cool relationship. I think you guys visited together. I think you guys committed on the same day together, too. What can yeah. you tell us about the relationship that you built with him? Uh, you know, I knew Bill going back when I played him at, at Oregon. You know, I played, played him, played Georgia. I met him there and just seeing him play at Georgia and just after the game, just how hype he was and everything. I just loved his energy. And then when I seen him on the visit, it was like a, a reunitement and I just loved it. Man, he just had the same energy and then just the same thing. And we're going to keep going. And I love Bill. Yeah, he's a good guy. I know Coach Aquino works with the DBs, but I'm sure you hear him out there. What is that like to hear Coach Aquino and, you know, the energy that he brings to practice? Coach Akina, as soon as he wakes up out the bed, man, he's always just, ah, energy, <laughs> energy, energy, energy. That's why I love him, man. And he's a great coach. He's a great coach. All right, that's our time. Thanks, Justin. Appreciate it.